Alabama wins their SEC opener, 82-64, the final score from Tuscaloosa. And joining us now, Javon Quinterly, career high, 24 points, three of five from behind the arc. Um, talk to me about where Alabama is right now as a basketball team because I've seen you guys a few times. This might have been your best all-around effort. How do you feel about it? Um, I feel like we came to play defensively. Uh, most importantly, you know, that end of the floor, um, I feel like the offense will, will always come, you know, as long as we're if we're guarding on the defensive end. So I feel like, you know, defensively we, we played a great game. It's still a lot of room for improvement. And um, to answer your question on where we are as a team, I just feel like, you know, everything's starting to come together. Um, you know, three, three, four good days in practice, uh, you know, led up to this performance. So, you know, we're just coming together as a team. Yeah, it's funny you mentioned practice because last year in practice you had a chance to go against one of the better point guards in the country in Kyra Lewis. What did you learn uh, from going against him night in and night out? Um, honestly, man, we learned a lot from each other. Uh, you know, I wish I got the chance to play with him last year. Uh, we would talk about it all the time, but I learned, you know, a lot from him, you know, making reads and, you know, we kind of just, you know, learn from each other because I came from, you know, a, a great program at Villanova and he would ask me questions about that program and, you know, we kind of just fed off each other a lot and, and you know, just, just taught each other a lot. Well, you're coming off 24. You're a, a new career high, but you've been posted double figures throughout this season. What was it about tonight that allowed you to, to square up for 24? Um, I feel like... Uh, you know, after sitting out two, pretty much uh, a year and a half of college basketball, you know, just just getting uh getting my feet wet a little bit. You know, it's taking a couple games, but I'm getting more more and more comfortable as as time goes by. And you know, tonight was just one of those nights where you know you could you could tell I'm kind of getting more comfortable and I'm making better reads and trying to set my teammates up and and myself. I love the fact how you said Kyra Lewis learned from me too. I respect that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what have you learned? What have you learned from Coach Nate Oates in regards to the type of style and pace that he likes to play? Um, it's just it's just very up tempo, but you know you have to guard. You know it's a, it's a it's a it's a fast tempo offense, but like it's not gonna work if if you don't get stops on the defensive end. So, you know these last couple of days in practice, he's been harping on me about about the way I'm guarding and. You know, that end of the floor for me. So that's something that I've, I've really tried to buy into and, you know, show the coaches night in and night out that I could, I could guard as well. Good win. 82-64. Open the season with a bang. Conference play. It only gets tougher for you. Javon, thanks for joining us. Good luck rest of the way, buddy. We'll see you down the road. Thank you, guys. Happy holidays. Same to Same you. Same to you. So Alabama wins it by 18. They put up 82 on a team that was given up just 53 points a game. 82-64, the final score from Tuscaloosa.